Welcome to The Right Time with Bomani Jones, YouTube exclusive, everybody's favorite game show, Unblock Me Bo. I feel like we should put a please on that, like please. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I agree. Me, Bo. I agree, <laughs> they a little presumptuous. <laughs> no, they just come in all aggressive like this. So yeah, we changed the name of the show, Please Unblock Me Bo, where uh, some Bomani Jones followers who've had their privilege of following him revoked, come on here and plead their case for why he should unblock them and allow them to get access to his content once again. All right, so we got three contestants today. The first one is Torrance R. Phillips from North Lauderdale, Florida. His Twitter handle is at who is trip. All right, Gabe, can you roll his plea? I like Torrance. I mean, just the, the just off the look of Torrance, he seemed like a guy <laughs> <laughs> who I could get down with. He looked like he know his way around a grill. He does. <laughs> he, he the dude that's like, I'll cook, but y'all got to bring the meat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm in a good place with Torrance. He got a nice orange shirt. My man, a little gray in the beard. I feel like Torrance. What did he do? Uh, in 2012, I decided I'd follow Bomani Jones from the Evening Jones and from uh, Highly Questionable over to my first foray into social media Twitter. So I made it uh, an account with an avatar, Prince avatar, uh, and an account with a fake name and followed Prince, my first follow. And then my very first, second follow was Bomani Jones, the reason I was here. Um, and lots of information came. You know, Bomani was tweeting left to right. It was fantastic. First thing I decided was, you know, I've been following this guy for all this time. I'm getting him to follow me back. So I asked him to follow me back. And lesson number one learned in Twitter, right? Because, uh, you know, I'm out here shaking my pom poms and everybody called me out for it. And there was no follow. And I doubt Bomani ever even saw it. Fine. Good. Lesson learned, right? But apparently I wasn't done learning lessons. So in 2013, uh, still trying to get a little bit of attention from Mr. Jones here for some God unknown reason. Uh, he tweeted out that, uh, but for the Aaron Hernandez case, he wouldn't have known about the Brady Bulls trial. And I responded back as in my attorney's voice talking about some uh, that might be an indictment on uh, his social perusal. Uh, and the Bobani Bo wrote back, indictment, huh? And I wrote back, man, just been trying to get your attention for a minute. You know, it's great to be on your radar, blah, 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 blah. All proud. Bobani responded to me. Uh, and then Twitter got quiet, you know, I, I didn't, I'm not on Twitter a lot, but I just noticed Bobani wasn't tweeting very often. And that, that seemed a little strange. And so a couple of days go by. And I searched Bomani up, and that, that's when I learned that uh, the social media has this thing called block, and I had found the block <laughs> button, or, you know, been the recipient of my first block. Uh, so since 2013, I've been blocked, and, uh, you know, I still listen to Bomani on every other platform he's on. Um, you know, big fan of him, been there since he was doing things on Stitcher. Uh, so, you know, it'd be great if I had an opportunity to get back as a follow, but if not, that's, it is what it is. I appreciate the opportunity to do this here. And uh, I did want to say on a serious note, very much thank you for the way you use your platform, brother. Um, you're not just entertainment, your information, you know, they can call it infotainment if they want, whatever they want to call it. But, you know, just just you keep blessing us and just keep doing what you're doing, bro. Thank you. I feel like I need to tell him thank you for all the nice things uh, yeah. that he said. I, I, I need people to y'all do understand where I was coming from here, right? Like, <laughs> like do you understand? Like, I, 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 I kind of feel mean, the need to explain right fast. You, you don't have to explain yourself, but I got to be honest. I don't completely understand what, like, my man was his first. I, I guess I was, I was shocked that you blocked him after the second response because the first response, eh, I could get you a block. But then it was just clear that my man don't know what's happening on social media. He just wanted the, the superstar to say hi to him. I know, and that's not behavior that I'm inclined to respect. <laughs> uh, you, that's all I'm saying. Okay, look at me, yeah. look at I me, mean, look fair. at me, look at me, look at me, look at me. That's all I'm saying. But like, when I put a face to it, and I would be honest, yeah. when the face, that face, and it's the grill master, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I'm like, mm -hmm. damn, okay. Like, you got to realize it was 2013. I was like coming into my own as a public figure. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, like that's the thing about it is I see myself as a regular dude. And so when people do stuff like that, I'm like, you know, straighten your back up, you know, <laughs> have, 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 have some, have some dignity. But you know, I was probably, that was probably a little bit too harsh. And I apologize to Torrance for that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. No, I don't I apologize, was, but yeah. I mean, I may have been tripping. <laughs> All right, well, we'll leave him there for now. We'll see if he is the winner. Next, we got Nakia Kaiser from Boston, Massachusetts. If you oh, he ain't getting a block. Oh, 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 let me do that again because I said he, I mean, I said she. 
Next, we got Nakia Kaiser from Boston, Massachusetts. His name is at big underscore keys, K-E-E-Z. Okay. Let's see. Let's see here, because you say he from Boston. Let's yeah. see what he got. I initially thought I was a victim of friendly fire and that I caught a random stray block from you. <laughs> but after digging in the crates a little bit, I saw a tweet from back in 2015. It was after the Patriots had smashed the Steelers in a season opener and Tomlin had implied that there was funny business with their headsets because of the Patriots. So everybody chimed in about the usual, typical Patriot hate. But when the league released a statement saying everything was everything, I didn't see the same energy online. Anyway, my tweet was, let me guess, you're not going to tweet out the NFL statement on this either. Don't tell me ESPN Adi got you too, Bo. Now, was I talking ish? Sure. But was it block worthy? I'm not one of these cats to be all in the mentions talking reckless. I'm a big fan. I'm a Evening Jones Combat Jack interviews kind of fan. So I'm here at Appeals, seeing if I could get out on time served. <laughs> so why don't you go ahead on and unblock me, Bo? Peace. <laughs> I mean, once you start with that, let me guess. I don't really need to. Like, I'll, it's your tone. Yeah, he did. He didn't. He wasn't contrite. He said he did. He served his time, but yeah. I mean, you got to come out in front of the parole board and and have some apologies in order. I feel like. Yeah, let's let's see though. Let's see though. Let let's see what what's going on with the with the next one here. All right, all right. <clears throat> Third contestant is Olawase Dorasoga from Dallas, Texas. You can follow him at Wazi underscore. Uh Oh, it's a Yoruba from Dallas. Oh, this could be anything. <laughs> Roll it. What's good, Bo? What's good, Gabe? So my submission for Unblock Me, Bo, I believe I had tweeted Bo or replied to one of Bo's tweets stating, hey, you might as well just get on the conversation, have a conversation either on your show or Will's show at the time and just have a discussion about whatever the topic was. I think Bo replied to me and said, why would I do such a thing? And I replied with a Jay-Z lyric, like a, uh, I guess it'll be like a grand closing, grand, grand opening, grand closing, something like that. And I'm guessing Bo didn't take kindly to that specific line, Jay-Z line. And since, I wanna say since June, 2020, I've been blocked. The reason why I think I should be unblocked now is because I want to say maybe a few weeks later, Joe ended up on Will Kane's show, called in, you know, they had their little discussion and went viral. And I was, I'm sitting here like, so why was I blocked then if you ultimately, but that's besides the point. So that's why I think I should be unblocked. Hey fool, you had the ability to edit this video. You know that, right? Right, yeah. right, 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 yeah, like right, yeah. right when you when you got to that part to the end right there, you could easily press stop and start it over because you kind of talked yourself out of it, right? First of all, all of this, it's all adding up now. The Yoruba from <laughs> Dallas thought that I needed to go talk to Will Kane so we could have a hearty discussion. What he don't understand is when I called Will's show, I didn't come to talk to him. I came to destroy him. I came to embarrass him. It was his last week at work. I can't do that to him if he still work here, right? But you thought it would be just, oh, an exchange of views between two people who disagree. I don't do that. Not that I don't talk to people who I don't agree with, but I'm just not out here in the disagreement for sport business. You know what I'm saying? Dallas. Dallas had to pop. Okay, all of it, all of it all makes sense now. And then like, but what about, well, what about you? You wasn't talking about doing what I did on the back end. And you know what's terrible about this? After the first two cats, it was going to be Christmas, man. Or like Christmas yeah. Eve. I was going to let everybody back. Right? I, at first two cats, I was like, I can see where y'all are coming from, right? Maybe I just give a pardon to everybody. But then that last dude was so everything, and I was just like, nope, nope, you can't come back <laughs> under any circumstance whatsoever. You can't. It ain't happening. 
All right. I have to Therefore, agree with your assessment, but did did it change? Did it change the way you felt about the other two? Like, did he take you out of the mood you no, were in? No, no, no. Okay, he okay. just he just messed it up, right? Because the second place finisher was going to get in, but now he can't. So sorry, uh, uh, big keys. Yeah. You need your big keys. You gotta blame this on uh Dallas man. Wazzy. Wazzy. Yeah, Waz. Yeah, Wazzy went and messed this up for you. But my man at first, who is Trip Torrance? You're right, man. I ain't have to do you like that. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Big Keys, I also appreciate you. Wazzy, I see why you got blocked. <laughs> Gabe, do we have... Uh, so we're, we're bringing in Torrance, right? That's the guy. It's the champ. Can we bring in Torrance? And tell him the good news. You can bring Big Waz out here, too, if you want to talk. <laughs> See what else he can talk uh, himself out of. Uh, not Big Waz. Big Waz is somebody different. Yeah, you don't want to get that Mr. Yeah, no, I like Big Waz. Big Waz is yeah, the yeah, homie. Yeah, I, like I like Big Waz. Waz. I like you don't Big like Wazzy. No, Wazzy, I ain't got no props for. But Torres, all right with me, man. What's going on, dog? Hey, Bolani Jones. It's my pleasure, sir. How are you today? Good, man. Dominique concluded, and we agree. When we saw you in the orange check, we like, you be grilling, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, it comes with the age and the great patch, man. You know, you got to do that, right? <laughs> yeah, man. No, nah, I was just telling them, you know, back in the day, you know, I, I, I don't take myself that seriously. So people like wanting to get my attention and stuff just felt a little weird to your boy. You know what I'm saying? But now I'm doing better with those things. It, it was justified, man. I mean, I'm out here really <laughs> wild and not doing my best I, I, for some reason. And I still don't understand why. I was just compelled to get to know him. Like, I, nah, I, I listened to I, this I mean, man for years. We must be friends, right? <laughs> In your defense, like you said, it was your first foray into social media. Like you ain't really know what you was doing. You was just figuring it out. It was 2013. We forgive you, or well, Bomani forgives you, and we're happy to have you. Yeah, we we back was a all the we was all figuring it out. I think I told you at Gay Theory when we had the audience. I came out and I saw a couple of my friends on the front row, and I got excited and I dapped them up. And it was right after Carolina B. Duke, and so. It was some dude who had a Carolina shirt on, so I wanted him to stand up so he could put it off for people. And he tried to give me a hug, and it turned into like a, that scene in Boomerang. You know what I'm saying? When that dude tried to come hit Eddie Murphy with the, it was like, ah, I'm learning. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate the affection. It could just take me off guard sometimes. Hey man, I people mean, be out here trying too hard, and I was definitely one of them. <laughs> you know what I nah, mean? Nah, man, like, but you, you all good, man. You back? Uh. Big Keys, man. I really feel bad for him. Is Big Keys still still hanging around? I want to. Is Big Keys there, Gabe? Because if Big Keys is there, I wanna. I wanna just tell him that we still homies. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I can let him. In. Yeah, let's let Big Keys in. Big Keys, man. What's going on, man? Hey, what's going on, Bo? Yo, you know what I realized? It ain't even fair to you almost. Because I saw the Boston, and I was like, okay, I definitely ain't gonna be riding with this man. Y'all be jerks. And you know, and to be honest, as far as Boston standards go, your let me guess was very low on the Boston jerk pantheon. You know I'm what saying. I mean? See, you know I'm what? saying I'm, I'm totally aware of that, especially as a black Estonian. I know some of the energy is Ben Affleck Boston, but I'm Bobby Brown Boston, brother. Yeah, but some of that Bobby Brown Boston be coming at me crazy too. There's okay, one dude, okay, there's one dude that's like on site with me about Boston. And I'm like, damn, I don't even remember what I said. But you know what? As I think about it, me and you good. You know what I'm saying? What? Like, like, you know, you, you, you looking like Al the tool assistant boiling right now. I can tell you a hard working <laughs> man. You know what I mean? So big keys, big keys all good. Torrance all good. Where your boy Wazzy at? Is Wazzy Ooh. still in the room? We're you want me to let Wazzy out? I, I yeah. Can let yeah, right. Wazzy. Come on in, Wazzy. <laughs> Yeah, you good. I'm glad I, I put on a button up for the parole board. That's, that's what I'm saying. You know, I appreciate the extra effort that you made there. That's what's up. Now, yeah, big wide. We got edged up for this one. Yeah, I wish I had it. <laughs> I just went to treat. I went from growing this hair at first. Everybody be happy for me that I get my HBO show, and all everybody want to do is clown. Let's see how y'all get down. There he is, Wazzy. Is that big. what you pronouncing it right? Uh, woozy on Twitter, yeah. Oh, Woozy. Okay, W O U Z Y underscore, right? Yeah. So I, I mean, I, I I'm sorry to cut you off, Bo. I know you were welcome in the room, but I mean, I gotta be honest with you. You your your energy on your video was like it was like presumptuous, like yeah, you just expected. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me, me? Let me, let me, let me. <laughs> 
Gabe, is the audio coming through? Hold on, hold on, Bo. Yeah, Dude, boom. Like, hold on. You got me? There you go. There we go. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, just, just let me handle it right fast. By the way, anybody ever tell you you look kind of like Scarface? Oh, yeah. You see it? You see it? I do. I do. I yeah, he look a little like Scarface. Yeah. I don't mean that it's that, shade. I just mean you look nah, a little that's... bit like Scarface. I'm not going to lie. I've never seen Scarface. Not the movie, the rapper. Oh, okay. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, you know, you know. Oh, this is reaffirming. This is reaffirming every decision I've ever made. Look, that's all, that, that, that's, that, that's all I'm trying to figure out right now. I wanted you to meet these other two cats because they coming back and you not, because you got, oh, first of all, you was like, oh, why don't you go talk to Will? What? I see him at work every day, right? Then, then in your video when everybody else is like, yo, can I get back? You like, you should have never blocked me in the first. Why is it that whenever I talk to one of my Yoruba brothers, it always go like that? I don't know. I don't know. I felt, I think because I knew what eventually that interaction between you and Will was going to be, I figured this would be, you know, it'd be good to be, be out there in the atmosphere. So I was like, all not right. too late, Woozy. Anything. Woozy, Woozy, it's not too late. The man, the man, get, he's in a good mood today. And he told you what, what went wrong in the video, and he let you in the room, which he didn't have to do. I'm just saying, maybe defending yourself isn't a, isn't a strategy right now. I'm just throwing it out there. I don't want to defend myself. I guess I just want to kind of explain the my thoughts. So not the strategy, but contrition. When you go in front of the parole board, <laughs> contrition, uh -huh. accept your faults, tell them you learned uh -huh. your lesson, and you are ready to be re into society. You're right. I, granted, I've never been in front of that type of situation, but I understand. None of us have been in that type of situation. <laughs> Why did you feel the need to say that? And, and, and on a similar note, throw that Louis Vuitton bag away. It's empty. You <laughs> bought a goddamn keychain, and now you're holding the bag up there trying to flex <laughs> an empty bag. Yes, I bought a satchel, but you're right. Eventually, you just like, can't help yourself. <laughs> it, is, it is just completely beyond you. Oh, you just man. can't. Oh. Yo, I, yo, I got it. I want to meet your friends because they all are me right now. I know they are. They be wanting to like you. They really do. They be trying. I used to be that guy. It, I guess it depends on the scenario. Most times, most times I don't care, but be right. The Howard? Is that a Howard sweatshirt? Yeah, Howard track and field. Oh, okay. What, what, what event did you run? Uh, scholarship was uh, for the 800. See, see, Gosh. see, see, Gosh. see, see. I can't, no. I can't. You lost me. You lost me, Woozy. I'm, a, I'm a fighting for you. I'm fighting <laughs> for you, but you lost me too. <laughs> oh. Man, I didn't, right. have the, I didn't have the fast switch muscles, you know, that most folks are born with. So I had to, you know, Figure but you don't, even, you don't even know what you said that, that lost me. I asked you what event. And Dominique, what did he say? Scholarship. Thank you. That's how we... <laughs> yes. Yes. See? That's what I'm saying. That's why everybody in there, big keys see what the problem oh, is. Oh. oh, man. You know <laughs> what, know. Dominique? I, I was fighting for you, brother. I mean, I got to give you I got to give you this, Woozy. You have been great. For the content part, like uh, this whole second part of the episode has been a lot more fun because you're bringing good but, energy. So, that's but, Dom, but Dominique, but Dominique, yeah. listen, you're a when you when you got your your Howard, sorry, not Howard, your Harvard uh, master's degree. You know, you 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 spoke about it. You know, whenever you saw fit, I didn't. The whole scholarship part that was kind of just like a you trigger. I, mean? I think I think I think that you are probably a good dude. But we have given you multiple opportunities, and, and it don't hey, go right every Brandon, single time. And I'm I'm literally like I'm like halfway working at the same time, so I'm okay. like still in work yeah. mode. So hey, 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 Woozy, just tell me this, man. How many meters are in scholarship? Right? <laughs> I asked you what event you ran. You said scholarship. Is that like the steeplechase? You know what I'm saying? Like, like it's an actual event. They just call it something else. It's the scholarship. You got to run from the library to financial aid. Is that what it is. I mean, at Howard's, uh, that financial aid office yeah. was, was something else. But oh. you're right. 800 yeah. meters. That was my thing. There, thanks, 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 thanks. 800 meters. Way to go. All right, so two people are getting unblocked, and hopefully one has learned his lesson. <laughs> See you, fellas. Yes, thank you, fellas. Appreciate you, gentlemen. I appreciate you. Hey, I'm trying. Why you? Why he got the plastic bag? 
for the plastic bag. He tried to flex a Louis bag with the plastic bag in the sink. Uh, uh, under you see that? Look, look. Yeah, at the, I see it. I see. Can I explain? No, 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 no. Your explanations <laughs> never help. <laughs> Let's go to the real show. Let's get up. Got up there like a book in I'm, I'm embarrassed for my man. Good luck to you. Have a good day at work. All right.